So when you're ready to put your walls together, you are going to, of course, score, slip, stick, and smooth. So to first, oh, well, first I'm gonna put my wall, my wall's gonna go right here. So I started scoring here, making sure I'm going in both directions so it looks nice and messy. And then of course, this is the side that's actually going to touch here. So I'm gonna score this side as well. So I have good deep scoring so that my two Velcro pieces will stick. Then of course, I'm going to take my slip, smooth that in there, take some slip, smooth that in here. And now I'm going to stick. So now I'm on my third step. I'm gonna push down as hard as I can without ruining the shape of the walls. And then I am definitely gonna smooth. Your walls you definitely wanna smooth even though before it was potentially optional. So I'm gonna smooth the inside of my wall, which of course no one's really gonna see very well anyway. I'm gonna smooth this little edge because this little crack is definitely not something that looks good. So you don't want your piece to have a little crack like that in it. So I'm gonna take my knife, smooth that guy out, which makes it sturdier and looks better. Now I'm gonna come over here, do the same thing. And then you see the edge is looking pretty janky right now. So again, I'm going to smooth that guy out. And your wall might bend just, if it's still a little soft, it might bend a tiny bit, but if, when you're done, you're just gonna prop it back up the way that I just did. So now I have that one wall pretty well attached. So now I would go ahead, I'd add my second wall here. Of course, my second wall, I would need to score here, but I would also need to score here because now there's two points of attachment. And then of course, my other piece that I'm adding on, I would score on one edge and I would score on the other edge so that when I attach them together, they both have already been scored. So one more step you're gonna do for your walls just to make them extra sturdy. You see, I have a little piece of clay here. I'm gonna roll it out like I have, like I'm making a little snake. It can be pretty thin. Can be a little thinner than your pinky. So now this guy is also going to get attached right here. As I know, anything that ever gets attached is going to have to be scored. I'm gonna cut this guy off first so that they're the same length. And now I am going to score there in that corner. And I'm gonna score all the way down this guy also. I'm gonna add my slip to both of them. I'm gonna smush that guy in there. And I'm gonna smooth it out. And it got a little long again, which is fine. I'm just gonna go ahead and cut that little bit off cut this little bit off. And so I would do that in each corner after I've put the walls on. Again, this is just one more way to really make sure that your walls are sturdy and that they're not gonna fall down uh, and crack when they're in the kiln. 